Okay, so the leg press has just come free, so we're just going to continue on to our leg press. Um, so, this is a leg press machine. This, could, this works like your quads and calves, and then depending on, leg, on foot placement, it can work glutes as well. So, what you're going to do is you're going to sit down. You've got the yellow little toggle here, yeah. and you pull that up, and you can slide it forwards and backwards. Um, I'm going to slide it to about number three and then I'm just going to put my feet onto the board in the middle, just centre um, and then you're just going to adjust your weight. So we'll go nice and light just because obviously we want to ease you into it and then you're just going to use in your quads and then pushing through the force of your feet, you're just going to push it away from you. Be careful not to lock your legs because it can cause damage um, and then you're just going to bring your knees back to your chest you can count to about three or four when you're bringing your legs back so one two three four and then you're pushing away again remembering not to lock your legs and then you're just going to do this and then once you're done just slowly bring it back watching the weight placing it down nice and gently and then being careful not to trip over this bar. Um, and then stand up, we'll have a walk around. So again, you're going to do 10 reps of this. So how do I know if this is in the right place? Does that feel comfortable? Yeah. So if you were to put, push your legs out for me, if we just lower the weight seconds. Yeah, just to that one, then push that out for me. And then bring it back in for three. Yeah. So you know because your knees are going towards your chest. Um, how did that weight feel? Is that of interest? Is that okay? Yeah. Um, okay. And then obviously make sure, I forgot to mention, but hold on to the handles. So you can rest your head back um, if that feels comfortable. Yeah. For some people it doesn't. So if you just want to continue on with this, so we've got ten of these. Um, so push your legs out and then back in, counting one, two, three, and then push out again. Okay, just four more left. Really good control on your way back. Just moving around you just from different angles just to check what's how your form is and stuff. Okay, and then slowly lower it in. Then you can bring your feet down. And then just stand up, have a walk around. Um, again, we're going to do just one minute rest. Just, again, check in on my watch, the time. Um, and then we'll do the last set of them. How did you find that? Good, but okay. I try it just for a Yeah, that's fine. If you feel like you're able to go up a weight, that's fine. You have got these little weights on here as well, which just adds, like... This one here is what 2.3, then you've got like one kg there. If so you, did you just those yeah, off? literally just slide it across like that. But always make sure that it's been you put it back after yeah. you finish using the machine, just making sure that it's left how it was when you came to it first. Okay, if you want to jump back on there for me. Yeah, and then when you're ready, just push forwards. Remember, you are going for 10. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, 
eight, two more, nine, and ten. Perfect. Slowly bring it back into you. Just so the weights don't bang and make noise and damage the equipment. And then legs off and then mind the step over. Did that all feel okay? Yeah. yeah? Um, okay, so now we're going to use onto some free weights. So we're going to just go over to the chest press and we're going to do a bench press. Um, let's just grab these. Just move it. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to bench press. We're going to see how you get on with this bar. If not, I'm going to switch it over to a smaller um, bar for you. So, I'm going to sit on the bench like this, lying down, making sure to watch your head. So, when you're here, when you look up, the bar should be in your eye line. So, right now it's not in my eye line, I'm looking up here. So, you move down a little bit and then it should be eye line. Then Usually where the um, serrated bumpiness is, the grips, you can put, just line this part of your hand up with that on an overhand grip. But it also depends on your, um, how wide your shoulders are apart. So for me, I just have to put my hands a bit here. And then you're going to push up, push over, making sure to get it off the hooks. Nice um, little arch underneath your back, chest up. And you're going to bring it down to your chest and then push up again. Down to your chest, push up again. And then bring it back and drop. And then you can let go and then come out from underneath. Um, I will spot you on this one. Um, but we'll just see how you get on with this bar first, see if it's too heavy or not. So I'm just going to walk around the back of the equipment. Have you got any questions about that before you start? No? So if you move down a bit more, is that now in your eye line? Yeah. So if you want to line up there to these two lines, overhand grip. So if you want to, yeah, over, yeah. And then if you want to push up, push up, and then you're going to lift it over. How does that feel so far? Does that feel too heavy? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm just going to go and get you a different, I'm just going to go and get you a different barbell to use. Okay, so we're going to use this one. This one is only, it's just 10 kg, so you will find it a lot easier. Um, I'm just going to have to move this. Will you hold on to this for me? So I can move this out of the way. And then I'll place it back once we're finished because obviously this is where it belongs. So I'll hold on to this. So if you move down for me. Hands where they were before, overhand grip, like so. Then I'm just going to keep my hands underneath. And then so you're going to move it over your chest. Yep. And then you just lower down to your chest and then push up. One, gonna do 10 of these. Two, three, four, five, six, three more, four more, seven, Eight, nine, and ten. 
perfect. So if you just want to give yourself a little rest, how did that feel? Was that okay? Wasn't too heavy? No. Okay, perfect. Um, just making sure you keep your chest up the whole time. And then, so you'll feel like an arch in your back. So just make sure chest stays up. Um, but as long as that wasn't too heavy, that's fine. Just give yourself a bit more of a rest. How have you found the session so far? Good. Nothing's been too difficult. Not yet. No? <laughs> Not yet. Okay, great. Um, just give yourself a couple more minutes. Again, just using my watch. Time this. Where did you feel that in your muscles most? Well, it's sort of, it's like chest, isn't it? Because yeah. bench press can work your chest, your shoulders. So it just varies on different people. And also what weight you lift. Okay, so if you want to lie back down now. Again, hands line up properly with the bar. Overhand grip. Move it over to your chest. Okay, and then if you just want to continue. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. nine one more ten perfect is that okay yeah. yeah you can sit up you can grab a drink if you need to i'm just going to go and pop this barbell back on the rack So, we've just got one more, which is um, again. I'm gonna have to stop the video because we're moving on to back squat next. But all four racks are taken, um, so I'll come back to you when one is free.